Knox County School Superintendent Bob Thomas says he has a clear understanding of how the investigation will proceed after hearing from the District Attorney General Sharm Allen. 10 News anchor Robin Wilhoyt did sit down with the superintendent in an interview this afternoon. He spoke about the steps the school system is taking to address any safety concerns at Austin East. In recent weeks, the district did add extra security cameras. The superintendent also says the school board is open to weighing the cost and benefits of adding metal detectors. Right, I, I think the, uh, we, we're going to listen uh, to the community, and I think we have to do our part to try to show that uh, that we are listening and uh, and 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 doing everything that we can to help make parents and 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 the folks in the community feel safer. And if that's what uh, if that's what'll do that, then uh, certainly we're you know we're going to look into that. The superintendent added schools do have the ability to randomly search students coming up in the next half hour. How the district is working to support the almost 650 students and 150 staff members at Austin East. We'll also hear from him about virtual learning and masks for the coming school year. Our coverage continues online. There you can see the very latest details in the shooting investigation from the TBI. You can also hear more from community members about the need to heal and see the very latest in the investigation of four other shooting deaths in East Knoxville this year. We also have resources at WBIR.com and through the WBIR app for help.